who do you play in top five? Oh man, mm. my role in it is so insane. I'm, I've been telling people that I'm just basically like a girl that you hope you never meet. Like I'm like your, I'm like every guy with a little bit of money, like his worst nightmare. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. I got to get hella ratchet for this role too, which was so much fun because <laughs> it's so different from. How what I did am. you go method or were you just did you draw yeah. from somewhere? I actually did. So I had done this like fashion show like several years ago with this girl mm. who had like no shame in telling me that she just like follows athletes around and sleeps with them for money. Wow. And and I was like shocked. Like I I was I was like floored. Like I could not she knows believe what that she people wants like this. No exist. shame in her game. And she was like, "Well, I got to make at least eleven thousand dollars a month, and this she, is how I do it." And she was, and she was like proud that she was like teaching her daughter to like be the same way. And she was like telling me like all the athletes. See, that's that she's where I got to draw the line. Yeah. But go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you uh, off. But no, it's ahead. crazy. And then she said <laughs> something about like I blew on this nigga's chips. He gave me, but I think that's like a euphemism for a blowjob, right? Because <laughs> 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 I was like, because no, might have been big. I think the story wasn't Vegas, but I was like, wait, because I will literally blow on somebody's <laughs> yeah. like, like, like. Chip. But you don't no, blow on a chip. Nah, you blow on a dice. Like, like people was doing that shit, like at the roulette no, table but you or something blow on like that. Dice. Like you don't blow on the chips. They, you know, she said, the chips "I blew this nigga's chips. He gave me a thousand dollars." Yeah, if you win, you just be like, hey, uh, here's a little thing. Thank you for uh, good luck. So uh, that's I'm assuming she sucked his dick? Yeah, that's no, what I'm assuming. She had to have sucked his dick. I don't think it's a euphemism. Right? She might I mean, have anyway. Anything. But I think you're giving her way too much credit. <laughs> yeah. I think anything she probably can did. be. Yeah, for $1,000. Yeah. I, I yeah. watch this nigga's dishes. That's, <laughs> that's sucking his dick. <laughs> to me, yes. I charged his phone. Yeah. That's anything. Everything is sucking dick, honestly. Let's just be honest. Especially if you get paid $1,000 afterwards. Yeah. I know. That's the key point. That's the key evidence. Yeah. You got a G? This girl was out of control and I, and I just like at the time I remember being like grossed out but also recognizing like the comedy in it like I was like this is hilarious you're the funniest person I ever met yeah. and so like years later I gotta like bring her back for this role like that's yeah. I just hey, kind of like real with her it. the whole time nice. she's a pro she's she was a pro professional I wonder if she's still alive, that girl. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so, man. I'm pray for her. And her daughter. Hopefully, you know, and she... her daughter, yeah. Good God, man. Hopefully, she hit it big and, you know, got pregnant no, by one of them. she hit it big. Oh, you know? well, that's hitting it big. Oh, man. For them, I that feel like, it, I feel it like for them, that's hitting it, it big. It has to be. That's the lottery You're right, right there. <laughs> You're right. Uh, like, I ain't got this. But then what happens when your guy, like, replaces you for the new girls who are trying? Well, you already locked in. Yeah. Yeah. Child yeah. support. Yeah. yeah. That's oh, what you got to yeah, get because the... she would tell us stories about, like, athletes would put her up in places mm -hmm. or whatever, and then she would get paid even more money so that their wives and stuff didn't find out. Yeah. Shit. That's how them CEOs be getting away with that shit. Oh, yeah. And politicians. You know that's, they oh, yeah. pay them that's off. What, that's how uh, Steve yep. McNair, the football player, got killed. Yeah. Killed? Killed. His He was putting up mm. his mistress... And then he was, I guess, putting his mistress out. And she was like, nah, I ain't having that. So uh, she, she killed him. She killed him she in his sleep. Him. Cold blooded herself. Yeah. Killed herself. Yeah. Killed herself. <laughs> yeah. Murder suicide. You know so crazy? The whole time I worked at the W in Hollywood, every single day I was just waiting for that murder to happen because I worked the night <laughs> you shift. You knew about this. Oh, murder. you knew about this? Well, I knew about it wasn't at the W in Hollywood. This is like somewhere else, but like at the W, I worked the night shift, so I saw all the celebrities come in, and they were just blunt. Don't let nobody call my room, especially my wife. But I also feel like if you're gonna if you're gonna be fucking with like an athlete or a rapper or whatever, like you should expect it. Like that comes with the territory. Yeah. Right. The I would, I would yeah. think I would think you need to set up some kind of uh, R R A or four hundred one k for yourself if you're gonna be a profession now and be you know. Jacking off these niggas for their money and shit. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, you gotta have some safe way for a rank you day. Set up okay. a rank day. You gotta just be smart to. about your money. That's be the smart thing about that's it. Sad you know what is like, this Treat girl like a was job. definitely spending her money on like hair weaves mm -hmm. and like plastic yeah. surgery. I can tell. Yeah. She said, I need to make 11000 a month. A what is your expenses? And to pay for her like fancy She had like a Range Rover or something. And Jimmy Choo's and all that kind of shit. Exactly. Oh, shit. Exactly. Got the Jimmy Choo's. That's nuts. We taught you how to put some Jimmy Choo's on. It's so crazy because it's like, obviously, I, I kind of figured it was out there you know you see like you hear all the stories but it's just kind of like hearing that story about a yeah. girl that's just like blatant about it and just like mm -hmm. yeah this is oh yeah what I no and I've had other girls be like like I've had other and there's one girl I would love to say who, who it is but I can't no, go ahead call out like, like, say it off air I can't like, I'll <laughs> tell you guys off air but it like has also tried to like get me to like think like them like to be like nah you need to hang out with me girl and like Telling me like the the things that they do, mm -hmm. I don't know. It's so weird. Like recruit, like very people are very open with me about their stories like this, uh, and trying to like recruit me to their lifestyle of being like, like that. girl. Meet me at the W at yeah, ten. I'm exactly. telling you, 
<laughs> exactly. That's they need crazy. they need wingmen, wing women. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. I figured they wouldn't want you doing that because that's more competition. But I don't know. I, I guess it is a wing. No, and then one girl tried to oh. use one of her one of her reasonings too was like after she told me like that she only fucks around with rich guys and this and that. She was like, yeah, and if they try to throw me out, then I break into their house, I break open they safe, and I just stole three thousand dollars from and then a really she was famous Hispanic. rapper's name. She's not Hispanic. She's a black girl. You had the Hispanic then, accent in I? there. Like, yeah, <laughs> it sounded a little Hispanic. I was playing the colors game right she, there. <laughs> yes, you were. Man. She's, She's not, she's not Hispanic. But then she was like, I just broke into a safe and stole $3,000. Um, mm. And then as if, but if, yeah. if that was like a, like, would it be like encouraging for me to be like, oh, okay, cool. Yeah, that sounds so cool. After so after they I... throw me out, I can break into their safe <laughs> yeah. and I can steal $3,000. Yeah, like, so did you learn how safe? to break yeah. into the safe? So did so, you like get yeah. the code from while you were sucking so his these dick? women are professional criminals is all, at, at the same <laughs> professional time. Professional criminals. Hey, they're, they're while we on this stores. subject, That's nuts. it seems fitting. Y'all seen Lou Williams? Who? Lou Williams, the basketball player. Oh, oh well, he got two girlfriends. And that, oh, and yeah, that and they're cool with it. Yeah, and they're cool with it. Like it's out public. Oh, see, I think that's cool. He takes them to the games. They just sit next to one yeah, another. Yeah, they all on Instagram together. I'm just like, <clears throat> man. Hey, yeah. Hey. hey. You got it, man. If they, if they hey. like it, then what's if the problem? If they're into it, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah that's a player right there, boy. Authenticity, boy. <laughs> shout, hey, out, shout out to Fonte. Hey, Obviously, hey. he's a better player off the court than he is on the court. <laughs> hey, you know, he's just like, they just like, hey, he take care of me. Yeah. yeah. But maybe they like it. I know girls who are in relationships with like a couple. And they're into it. Really? <laughs> Ella you say so girls. You know girls like you more know than a one. lot of people. You said, <laughs> no, she said girls, meaning more than one. You know more than one Multiple. girl. Yeah, I know people Plural. who are like in relationships with not couples. a lot of people but i know people who are like in relationships with couples yeah and like really like both the people and like hope i need to go out. like just hang out with you one night you know a lot of interesting <laughs> yeah. people it's, it sounds like such an la i know it's a worldwide thing but yeah, only in la because somebody's like oh yeah i know some people who do that yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like if i met somebody oh you got your relationship yeah you know with uh tom and susan <laughs> what wait, wait with tom and susan and susan all right I feel like it probably Ooh. happens more than y'all are giving it credit for. Nah, like I know it do. It. it does. There's I, a lot of swingers and stuff out there. Nah, I know it is. I just feel like most people like a, don't like to talk about it. That's like a, a yeah. two-on-two tag team kind of thing. I've never heard of one person dating. A two-on-two tag team? Yeah. The swingers. The swinger? What Ta- is tag, tag in, tag in, tag out. Oh, tag in. No, but it's not two-on-two. <laughs> two. It's two-on-one. It's a handicap yeah. match. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I've never heard of that. I've never heard of the, the triple threat. It's a special event. <laughs> That's you know, interesting. The triple, the triple threat is them all against each other. It's a handicap. Yeah, yeah. you know what I'm always at the same like, time. At the same though. time, you know. <laughs> I always wonder how did the guy bring it up? How was the guy? Because I feel like the guy brought it up. Was like, <laughs> you want to add another girl to this relationship? No, Would you be cool with that? No, the girl probably has to be. She's bisexual. Yeah, and, so she'll and she like, mentions I like it like. So-and-so. Yeah, she probably says something like, "Ooh, she's hot," and he's just like, "Yeah, she is." Who you think is hot? <laughs> she he's is hot. Like, she is hot. Look, her breasts are so perfect. Yeah, I bet we both would like to see him. And then he just married the guy to snowballs. I did th- I did a little bit of with a woman one time. She was she was boring though. She didn't want to. Oh really? She didn't want to bring the other a, a girl in. I was just like, why not? That's selfish. She was like, I, whenever I'm with the girl, I like to just be with girls, and so I'm with you, so I'm, I'm just want to be with you. And I'm like, I know you talking about. I like saying like this all, bitch was boring because she wouldn't have. A she's all but she's all vanilla. Yes, this boring ass bitch wouldn't have a threesome. <laughs> it's like you can't be bisexual and not do it at the same time. Yeah, exactly. She was, she was, like, she was bisexual. Like, I thought I hit it big. I thought I hit like the I'm like yes. I was those like, things are not correlated. They're not. He was correlated. like, "Yeah, was good. Boring. I got me one." That's you should have so spun funny. that. Uh, you got to try everything once, kind of angle. Yeah, had you should just told it in. Before? You said, "Have I?" Had, no, had, had she, she had a threesome before? I don't uh, think she had. I don't think she had. Say, no. "Yeah, you missed yeah. the angle. You got yeah, to yeah, you try everything once." Yeah. You, know you got to be a better self. You should be like, "How do you, you know? Smoke, you, you were smoking green with her. That but was you probably have like your first time." You don't care that she's bisexual. Like, like you're not like turned on by it or anything. Like, you just have to be like. That's fine. You know, I've been with some bisexual girls before. It's not a thing. And then, <laughs> and then it'll slowly come back up. And then you See? gotta be smooth about the way you work it. See, I wasn't like 
oh perving on it like oh yeah you bisexual you want to fuck a girl with me I wasn't like that I was just kind of like I was just like really oh well He's like, that's Yo, not how I got your original this, uh, story right you were like she. I felt like she was like I'm bisexual and you were like you want to fuck a girl with me <laughs> no, and, that was and she said no and then you broke that, up with her because she was wrong. boring when she, when, she, when she told me that she was uh, bisexual I was like fucking right I, this is on my head you know like the uh, fireworks went off you know train horns blaring and shit I'm going crazy in my mind but I played it cool yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, well, that's always the most. You important. always gotta start. Wow. Yeah, I started real subtle. Be like, yo, got this king size bed. There's a lot of extra room. <laughs> I just think we could invite somebody just to, you know, come and share this <laughs> bed. That's how the bed right be cold the... all the time. I think we need to put somebody in it. <laughs> that should be dope, man. What you think? Would being bisexual be a deal breaker for any of you guys? Some guys are like yeah, nah. very anti that. I actually am. Yeah, I'm very concerned. No, I'm, 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 I'm a I complete hypocrite. No, it does not. I, I don't dig that shit. I, I laugh at it, but I don't condone that shit. You don't get that. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have very conservative roots. I'm sorry. Oh, nah, nah. <laughs> it, 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 it's almost a deal enhancer for me. I'm like, oh, really? Hmm. <laughs> nah. But you know, well, you it know, depends on that, how much in love I am yeah. because I don't want. It's already hard enough dealing with that. Uh, any dude, if he wants to, and I, I'm not on, on my game, can come take my girl. But now I gotta worry about girls. You take your girls. Come take your girls. Girl. Girl. But girls, yeah. but you know, but nobody's ever equally attracted to both sex. So it'll be like you're more attracted to one sex and kind of attracted to another. It's like you slide something on the spectrum. Yeah, slide it's a little that slider. scale, the Kinsey scale. Mm-hmm. It's, it's what? Like, it's, it's a it's, name it's, for it? Yeah, it's called the Kinsey scale. Oh, see, I was just bullshit. No, no, no. So everybody, so <laughs> the, the Kinsey scale. scale is a real thing and everybody's on it. And they say that nobody's completely straight and nobody's completely gay. And so you fall somewhere in it. But everybody who's gay or I'm completely like, straight. <laughs> fuck that shit. I don't lie. Fuck that. I ain't in no niggas. <laughs> 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 fuck that. Yeah, my butthole is exit only. <laughs> Let that be known. I would like to meet a black guy that only dates white guys. He's like, I can't fuck with I can't fuck with you niggas. They just... Tired of them, man. I can't fuck with them. Yeah, man. They just be so extra. <laughs> yeah, man. White guys know how to treat you. <laughs> yeah. He made me a sandwich afterwards and shit. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's, that's so hilarious. great. You guys should write that. 